All right, let's, uh, whoops, I'm gonna drop all that down. Let's get it started here. Um, this one is with you, Miss G. Oh, whoops. Awesome. Well, we are gonna take this out to Richardson. Um, and I talked to Miss Sue Ross. She's had some listings coming up and she's got more. This house had uh, five showings and five contracts within the first 30 minutes that it went active. So I don't think it's on anymore, but we just wanted to display it to know the price point at 179. That's first time home buyer. Um, it is three bedroom, two bath. It's a townhouse. It is in the uh, UT area. So young buyers, it's in Canyon Creek area off of 190. Uh, the main floor plan has casual living and dining, a half bath plus master bedroom, the basement transformation um, and the condo. Like I said, it does, it's not gonna last long. Before we could even take it off, it was already had an active open contract. So with that price point at 179, first time home buyer, it was not an investor that swooped it up. So great job, Sue, on that. And I know she's got some more coming up in the next couple of weeks. Well, that's awesome. Well, I mean, look, this just highlights the fact that if you're listing a house under $200,000, it ain't gonna last very long. Um, mm -mm. It, Absolutely not. Yeah, there's so, there's so many buyers out there in that price range right now that are trying to find homes and trying to get into something because they're tired of renting. <laughs> and these things just go quick. And uh, unfortunately, um, you know, you can still, it might be a backup offer. You might check it out. You never know. These things fall through. So it's, it's a possibility. Um, but either way, Absolutely. Susan's got plenty of other properties she can show you if you're interested in looking at something in this price range, right? Absolutely. All right. Wonderful, Susan. Well, hopefully uh, this one goes through and gets it closed and you do it quickly. All right. Next up. 